Just do a little video on, on them today. Why? What's it in regards of? Just no need to take a drone onto our site. I'll film, I'll film our site. What, what, I don't know why you're filming though. What is it you're doing? Oh, it's just something I do for social media. Go online and have a look. Can I see your license then? No, not at all. Hey? Not at all, no. Why? Why do I have to show you my license? <laughs> and welcome to my channel and this time we're doing this place here which is Kingstown Associates mail order made easy looks like what they're doing is taking over a car sales place because it's got all these windows down here but they're using it as a bit of like a storehouse I think so it's got uh, there's a possibly a reception there I'll go and have a look in a minute I think they do all delivering down there so let me just tell you a little bit about what these guys do okay so it says uh, we're the leading UK mail order company based in East Yorkshire owning several lifestyle brands predominantly aimed at the over 60s. We'll have a look at what those are now. So let's check out what the brands are. Okay, so it's Healthy Living Direct, Fashion Friendly, Garden Ability, Housewares Direct, Craft and Hobby. So those are the brands that they, they actually do here. So um, I've, there's a lady who stood outside the uh, reception there has seen me now, so they know I'm here and it uh, looks like somebody's probably approaching me at this moment so what we'll do is uh, we'll wait for this guy to come and then we'll do some zoom camera stuff after that Can I help? Uh, yeah what's uh, what's it you mainly do here huh? what's it you mainly do here what's it you film with? your company so i'm just uh, kingston uh, associates so i'm just doing a little video on, on them today why what's it in regards of sorry just on you i should stand here um, just, uh, it's, I just want to do really. So I go industrial estates and um, I just pick on companies that uh, I find interesting and just do a little video on them really. So, well, where's the video go? Uh, social media probably. So I'll go on social media, and then uh, what I usually do is I finish the video with a bit of uh, aerial footage. So I get me drawn out as well, just fly me drawn over, just see what I can see in the yard and things like that, and uh, yeah, just put it all together. No, there's no need to do that. What do you mean? Just no need to take a drone onto our site, I'll film, I'll film our site. So I'm going to step over here. Um, well, there it is, I need, I need to do it. Why? <laughs> because I want to do it for, for me, it's what yeah, I do. This is not your property. Well, I won't be on your property, I'll be, I'll be stood here. Yeah, so, so, no. Well, I will be. <laughs> well, I don't understand why. somewhere else. Pam? Go and do it somewhere else. I've done it already, I've done it all over the estate. Well, so it's just your turn now. <laughs> Why is it going on social media? I don't, I don't understand what you're doing. I just explained on. So. Well, yeah, but what are you getting out of it? What? Oh, it's, I, I love doing it. It's my interest. So I just do it and also I get paid. So I get paid for putting the videos up by uh, the YouTube ad, ads and things like that. So, so yeah, I can make money out of it. So, when I mean, you're shaking your head, I don't know. <laughs> you just got profit on Oh, right. It's very nice, is it? It's not very good for I me mean, social media. It's your property. Chance to sell your property now. So, your, your business. Tell us all about it. Tell us a bit more what you do. No, you are. How good you are. No? All right, okay. I'll go about here. That should be about easement, isn't it? To walk down the path here. Wow. Okay, guys. So, that's what we get from uh, Kingstown Associates. Terrible, terrible attitude. Right, so there he is. He's there uh, whinging now at the uh, the lady who uh, who saw me. She's just hidden behind that gate there, I think. I'm just telling him, some idiot out there with a camera. <laughs> So to be honest, there is uh, there is two companies in here as well. There's this uh, Thompson Global Logistics, which I'm uh, I'm assuming that's nothing nothing to do with this company. So what I might do I might just uh, I might just have a wander down and go to talk to Thompson Thompson Global Logistics Limited and uh, see what they say. Now these said this is his property here, which is, which kind of is their property. But I want to go down to Thompson Global, so what I might do is I wait till she's gone, and then I'll just go walking down there. So I'm just trying to figure out now. Oh, this is a high vis area, so I can't then. Yeah, sorry, I can't. It's a high vis area, so um, I can't really go down to them, unfortunately. Right, so. Um, 
what can we see? They've got loads and loads. So it is a mail order service. Looks like they're using Yodel as their uh, deliverer. So they'll be shipping through Yodel. Um, just loads of boxes, isn't it? I, can't, I won't be able to get into any labels. There's one there, but that's full zoom there, so I can't get to. I can't get close enough to that label. It's quite a way away. Uh, they've got the forklift truck there, bringing stuff in and out. So what we'll do is uh, we'll I'm going to walk up and down this bit here, and we'll be able to see in the windows whether uh, whether we can see anything in there. So I can't see any electric car charging at all. I see, it looks like an old uh, car showroom. And they've got now celebrating 25 years. 1999 to 2024. They're not celebrating very well, are they? So there is some uh, parcels in there. It's, uh, it looks like they're just using it as a storage area, so you can see lots and lots of packaging and shelving and stuff just behind there and then they may have they may have maybe an office area there because it's got blinds on it but if they are using it as a storage i think you'd blind it all up wouldn't you so nobody could see in got some look at led lights look see little four leds in it so they do have a uh, camera security on the corners there and one on the other corner up there as well so what I don't get is if I wanted to go to see uh, Thomson Global down there, look. Then how would I actually get in? Because I'm not sure whose car parking this is, but I would think that you park your car down here for Thomson's and then have a wonder to go see him. Now oh, where's he going then? Is he... Uh, Oh, he's part of this one, isn't he? So he's parking up there. Yeah, he'd be in the forklift. That's good. That's safety. So it looks like, yeah, they're just uh, sorting out. Now, is this a delivery or is this something that's going out? It's hard to tell, really. Can't tell whether they're delivering or removing. This guy's coming. I should make a little film. Oh, because I want to. It's not a business though, what are you doing? Oh, is it? Okay. So, tell us a bit more about it then. So, what is that you do here? Yeah. Sorry? What do you need to know? Just tell me a little bit about your business and, uh, because I... Mail order company. Kind of stuff. All right. So, and some of your big brands? Well, well what, what, I don't know why you're filming them. What is it you're doing? Oh, it's just something I do for social media. So, I go around industrial stage, make a little video on uh, their business that I find interesting okay. and uh, make a video and take a drone over, get some... Sorry? Go online and have a look. Well, yeah, I like to see it on the ground. I've got a drone as well, so I'll take my drone over to get some aerial views as well. So, thank you. So that guy's a business owner. So, yeah, it's, uh, I don't know, a bit abrupt really, aren't they? Uh, I don't get some of these companies, to be honest. I mean, it's like free advertisement for them, isn't it? And yet they always, uh, they always, I don't know, suspect the worst. So I think we're seeing most we can see with the, uh, with the Zoom cam. So let's get the drone up and uh, just check out how far it goes, I'm not sure if all of these units are part, part of Kingstown Associates uh, or whether they're owned by different companies, but we Whoa. should be able to see if there's any uh, company names on them from uh, with the drone. Let's go fly a drone. Can you see on drone assist there that there is no restriction to fly in this area? So let's go and have a look at Kingston Associates. Take off. Home point update. Right, so these are all the uh, the units. I'm not sure if they're all theirs though. So that's the uh, that's the reception area where the young lady was stood when I first turned up, and she went down and she informed the guy that uh, I was filming. He then came out the first guy in high vis, and then the second guy came out who was the business owner. Hmm. Can we see in here? So yeah, we've got loads to loads here, aren't they? So we can see in there. So it's just got loads and loads and loads of parcels, really, innit? I'm not sure if somebody else is coming out. Don't know, I'll see. Permission to fly that over here. Yeah. From Civil Aviation Authority. From who? Civil Aviation Authority. And why do you, why do you need to fly it over here? I don't need to, I want to. Why? 
Can I see your license then? No, not at all. Hey? Not at all, no. Why? Why do I have to show you my license? Because that's on our property. It's not on your property. It's over, it your, it's over your property. Well, what's the difference? Absolute massive difference. What if a uh, light aircraft fly over, do you have to see his license, his pilot's license, before he goes over? Hang on, you're still making these stupid laws up. I thought you might have understood about drone laws. Wow. Purpose of it? Can't hear you, you need to come here, it's wagons. Come here, I'll talk to you. I'll talk to you. <laughs> Can't hear you, mate. What's the purpose of the drone? I just like to get so. I come here and I just make a little. This car's going there. I just make a little video on a company and uh, do a little talk of social media and then I take my drone up, get some aerial shots and then put it all together for a video on social media. Why? Because that's what I do. So I, so I, like, I enjoy doing that. Okay, right, yes, okay, I think you guys should say, don't, you need to tell him it's interrupting drone pod, but the drone is static, I've got a good view of it here, so there's in no danger of me talking to him, I can see the drone, it's not going anywhere. You keep your eye on your drone to make sure that you're not going to hit anything or nothing's going to come in contact with you, there's nothing in the sky, it's totally clear, so stop whining you guys. Right, okay, so I think you maybe was watching this, I, I was talking to him, so that's three people that's been out now. I don't know, are they not talking to each other? Weird. Right, so this has got the Kingstown badge on there, look. So that's definitely uh, one of their units. But look at all that stuff in there. They have stacks of stuff. Still can't work out what they're doing with all this. Looks like they're, are they repalleting it? Right, where are they going with that? Okay, so she's taking it off a big, uh, I think they are just repalletizing it, aren't they? So, She's taking off this one big pallet and they maybe send it out to, maybe want delivering to customers or something, I don't know. Let's go a bit higher. Right, so on a look at, I wanna see whether they own these ones here. Hmm, don't know, there's no signage, is there? There's no signage, it looks similar though to the other one. So I think, I think we can safely say they, do possibly own those and this one here is that other company you see so this is the Thompson Global Logistics so a totally different company to them or do they use these guys to do oh, did that just open that's just open don't it Ooh. oh what is this is this part ah this this so this looks like it might be part of Thompson's Global Logistics aha Okay, so I might answer that one then. So look, he's, uh, are these all part of Thompson's? It's hard to tell because it's like a shared yard. So I have to assume that uh, these are part of Thompson's because they're parked down here. Oh, they're coming in now, look, so yay. Bring that stuff in and out. So that's a lot of stuff. Wrapped, ready to go to customers. Yeah, there's no signage that I can read from here. So I'm not sure, I'm not sure. Whether they own just the first unit, two units, three units, or they're also, oh no, this will have to be. So this unit here will probably have to be Thompson's because look, there's no, there's no other uh, roller shutter, is there? So they won't be able to get things in and out. So yeah, so I'm pretty sure that this unit is definitely part of Thompson's. Right, good. Sorted. Okay, so let's uh, have a little fly over and see what we can see. So yeah, straight away I'm seeing zero solar panels over the whole roof. Ooh. I mean, look at all this roof here. That could really take a lot of solar panels, couldn't they? But they've got none. Okay, so coming around here so we had the uh, so this was the main car park so I can't work out whether this is customers or uh, employees parking but it certainly looks like a car showroom doesn't it a bit of strange unit really and this so uh, there's me stood there look hello so here's all the rest of the parking so 
not too sure which company is which on the parking side. I assume those on the left are part of uh, the Kingsdown Associates and those on the right maybe are part of Thompson Global. Mm, who knows? Right, let's get in the middle and let's get up high and let's do a 360 of the place. Okay, let's get back to the whole place in one shot. Let's get it back and finish this one up. So I usually finish off with my DJI Pocket, but that's gone into updating mic mode for some reason. Don't know what that means. So I'll finish this with the, the body cam. So yeah, there we go. So that was a, a bit strange. We had three interactions there. All a bit strange. None of them very positive for, for the company. And guys stood in the window there as well looking. Yeah, they just they're stood, in, stood in there. So, um, yeah, he's still staring at us. I don't know what he's doing. And, uh, yeah. So let's give this one a score and let's move on to the next one. Mm -hmm. 